Welcome everyone, my name is Kelly and today we're going to do a STEM activity. STEM stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. Today's activity is all about science and we're going to look at ice and properties of water and what makes ice form. So for this experiment you're going to need a bowl with some ice cubes, could be a cup, and some sort of larger container to co collect any of the water that spills over. I also have a bottle of water. Um, this is bottled water from the store. This one has food coloring. This one is just plain bottled water. And these bottles have been in the freezer for about two hours and 45 minutes. They're still liquid, um, but they are very cold. So we're gonna see what happens when we pour that water onto our ice cubes today. So the first step in any science experiment is to make a hypothesis. A hypothesis is a prediction or what you think might happen. So take a minute, what do you think will happen when I pour the clear, regular, bottled water onto the ice cubes? What do you think will happen when we pour the colored water onto the ice cubes? Do you have an idea? Let's give it a try. All right, so we have the regular water opened and the colored water opened, so they're ready to go. We'll start with the regular water. Were you surprised? Let's see what happens when we add the colored water. Do you remember your prediction? Why do you think that happens? Well, have you ever heard that snowflakes only form when there's some sort of dust or particle for them to form their crystals on? Well, the same is true for water as well. So in the freezer, this water is cold. It's even colder than the regular freezing point of water, but because there's no particles in it, it's regular um, bottled water, it doesn't have anything to form those crystals on. So it takes a really low temperature to be able to freeze that water. When we pour it on the ice, it gives it something to freeze onto, um, forming your ice towers. You can try it with other colored water um, and also test out different times or lengths of freezing in the freezer. Um, if you leave it in too long, it will actually freeze your whole water bottle. Um, but there might be a specific length of time, especially for your freezer, that makes the best ice towers. So keep experimenting and have a great day.